previously on Life with the Rivers. Just because we moved to California doesn't mean everyone will just adore me for my designer clothing. Well, maybe they will. They'll adore me for myself, my creativity, you know, my athletic ability. Okay, okay, I get it. Just do what you want, but don't say I didn't warn you. I hope I don't fail. Mom's if I don't fit in. I'd say that secret code thing worked out pretty well. Plus, we caught away with sleeping in the playroom. Or so you thought. Kylie Sam! I'm very nervous. What's to be nervous about? Why are you shaking? I'm so excited! You are squeezing me to death. Oh, honey. I've loved you, and today you will be known as a preteen. <laughs> you stop, ma'am. Thanks. On the door and the night begins Cause we've done this before so you come on in Make yourself at my home, tell me where you been Pour yourself something cold, baby, cheers to this Sometimes you gotta stay in And you know where I live Yeah, you know what we is Sometimes you gotta stay in Welcome to my house, baby take control now We can't even slow down, we don't have to go a while Welcome to my house, play that music too loud Show me what you do now, we don't have to go a while uh, Welcome to my house And you know that you want to stay Close the blinds, let's pretend that the time has changed Hi, I'm Brooklyn Rivers and I'm new to this school Aren't we all? LOL, Daisy Dashhound over there has been there for like five years What's that necklace about? I made an art class. The one in the middle is a real glass bead. It was really hard to make. Oh, look at that adorable necklace. She even made it herself. <laughs> Guys, take it easy. I took one of the same art programs. That's where I made mine. Ew. That's just absolutely nasty. Go hang somewhere else. Besides, we aren't allowed chumps in our group. Yeah, just like go. Uh, no. Look what you guys did. Don't you know how mean and cruel you are? Why do I even hang out with you guys anyways? You're so stupid. E for effortless. T for trash. T for tragic. Totes. The word's totalicious, okay? Totes was so last season. Oh, totalicious. Totalicious. Hey, you okay? If you're like them, just leave me alone. I'm not like them. I have no one else to hang out with, and I've been teased because of it. So if I cannot get teased, then that's what I wanted to do. No, well, I really like your necklace. The colors go really well, and it matches your eyes. They're very pretty. 
Thanks. You really think so? Yeah, I do. Also, the bell's going to ring in five minutes. Do you want me to show you where your locker is? I've taken a, um, a tour of the school before because my sister showed me. She's a graduate this year. Really? My sister's a graduate this year, too. Cool. How will we get you your locker? Sounds good. So hot. Oh my dog. I love your dress. Where did you get it from? You know, it's really nice. Yeah, you should totally tell me. Let me guess. Macy's. Alright guys, class starts in a few minutes. But, who cares? You can keep gossiping over me. Uh, excuse me. Uh, uh, sorry. Oh. Watch it. Ugh. You okay? Ugh, yeah. I know you know my name's Brooklyn, but what's your name? Oh, I'm Whitney. Hi, Whitney. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. So, what locker were you in? Um, I'm in 115. Oh, that one's right here. Later. After first block. Thanks for helping me decorate. It really shows you're artistic. Hey, where's yours? Two spots over. The one with all the nerd stuff. Cool. You're not a nerd. You're nice. <laughs> Thanks. You know, we have one more block until lunch. Do you want to maybe sit with me? Sure thing. Way better than sitting with them. Tss. Can't imagine what they talk about. Yeah, you would not believe what they talk about. Once? She was talking about how Selena Phillips looks so fat. Isn't that what all mean girls talk about? But then, they told her to the, her face that she should go to Weight Watchers. Uh, I can't believe it. And she's just like a tiny stick figure. She's probably just jealous of her. That's what I thought, too. I mean, like, when you're jealous, you just talk bad about people. Well, gotta go to algebra. I gotta go to English. See you later. You too. Oh, back through the crowd. So class, tonight's homework. Page one, questions two to 20, and no exceptions. Got it? Cecile, wake up! What? You missed a lot. Too much work for a seventh grader. I'll see you next class. You too. By the way, what's your name? Oh, I'm Brooklyn. I just moved here from Canada. Canada, eh? What's your name? Uh oh. I'm Jason. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Well, I gotta go for lunch. Me too. See you around. You too. Miss Vondenstein. Yes, Harold. Why is this table made of teak wood and the others plastic? Budge cuts. Fascinating. What took you so long? Well, there is this cute guy in my class. Wow, you're telling me secrets like I'm your... Wow, you're telling me secrets like I'm your best friend already. 
Well, you are my only friend, and are we friends? Of course we're friends. I mean, why not? Okay, I just thought because you were friends with uh, Roxanne, the popular girl, and her two friends. Don't be silly. They're, they're total. And I mean total. Evil, non-genius masterminds. Non-genius? <laughs> well, yeah. All the best mark for them is a C plus. Nah. I thought they weren't so smart. In one of my classes earlier, I saw them doing their makeup at the at the table. They weren't even paying attention to the lesson. Yeah, I know. Anyways, about the cute guy. Well, he's one of the jocks. In fact, he's the one with the green eyes over there at the jocks table. Eat it, bro. Come on, eat it. Just eat it. Eat it. Eat it. Eat it. I'm more of a fan of a fish, but here it goes. Aw, oh, dude, that was nasty. What? Bones are good. To doges like you, maybe. Well, actually, his name's Jason. Dude, he always plays hard to get. So, don't get too confused when he's always hanging around the popular girls. Gotcha. Okay. Well... I'd better eat. Yeah, me too. Mmm, their fish sticks are not too lousy. Why, were they at your old school? Well, back at my elementary school, they didn't even have a cafeteria. What? The bell's about to go. That was a little strange. I've got, to, I've got to get ready for PE. Oh, yeah, I gotta go to band. Well, see you later. You too. Did you have a good first day of school? Sure did. How about you? It was pretty good. You know, thanks for sticking up for me. I think I'd be a loner if you didn't do that. <laughs> Same. I don't think I could handle them any longer. And I thought they were bad in elementary. Well, I'll see you tomorrow. You too. Bye. Bye. Oh, that's my ride. Hey mom, hey dad. Hey Brokey. Where's everyone else? Oh, they're in Olivia and Charlie's room. Oh, oh, okay. Wait. Huh? We have something for you. This is for you, for being so brave on your first day of middle school. Wow, it looks like a real package. Because it is. It was mailed from someplace else. She knows. Well, open it. Okay. This is a beautiful sweater. Dad, thanks for getting this for me. You're welcome, honey. Thanks for being so brave. It's not every day someone moves to a new country. Wow, I'm gonna wear this tomorrow. Okay, you do that. Mm-hmm. Thanks so much. Aw, you know we love you. Honey! Being brave comes with a price, but... It'll be worth it in the end. Yay. We've all been faced with hard decisions in our life. Moving here was one of them. But you know what? I had pride and I was courageous. And that's why I'm so happy now.